Hey there, did you know one U.S. president acquired whole new territories across oceans? Let's dive into the story of William McKinley's expansionism. Under McKinley, the Spanish-American War of 1898 heralded a new wave of expansion. America took a big leap forward as a global power. Think of it as America putting its first major stamp on the world stage. But how did McKinley pull it off? Let's talk tariffs. McKinley loved them high. The Dingley Tariff Act of 1897 was crucial in protecting American industry. Amid economic challenges, McKinley's policies paved the way for recovery and growth after the depression of the 1890s. His tenure wasn't just about winning wars or setting tariffs, it was about anchoring America in a thriving economic future. The Spanish-American War was more than just conflict, it shaped America's geopolitical footprint drastically. American industry changed forever under the high tariffs McKinley promoted. It thrived, shielded by the protective economic policies. McKinley's presidency was defined by innovative economic decisions, leading to a robust American economy. The high tariffs weren't just numbers, they were a protective shield for burgeoning American industries. Imagine a time when America was asserting itself not just locally, but globally. That's the McKinley era. The Dingley Tariff wasn't just policy, it was a strategic move to keep American goods competitive and industries thriving. McKinley had a vision, a vision where America's economy would not only survive post-depression, but flourish. Becoming a global power wasn't merely a consequence, it was a deliberate result of calculated moves by McKinley. His economic policies didn't just heal, they constructed a strong foundation for future unimaginable growth. Looking back, McKinley's actions were not just momentary successes, but foundational shifts for America.